Hey guys, so what's going on? Um, so today I wanted to talk about the whole evil lineup shit. I know I had a different video planned for today, but since I heard this announcement, I kind of want to give my two cents on it and actually kind of give my words. I'm actually going to be careful how I word this because if I say something too wrong, I could get, you know, castrated for it and I don't want it. So Marvel vs. Capcom Infinite is not going to be on the EVO 2018 lineup. And a lot of people are upset about that, especially on what games got in. For instance, for instance, a lot of people are upset because two Smash games are making the EVO lineup. All I gotta say is one reason I can think is maybe the player numbers or like the numbers itself. Maybe Marvel vs. Capcom Infinite wasn't as big as people thought it was and maybe it wasn't as big at all and maybe the player base or player count was just low as shit and they're thinking I don't even know how many people are going to compete they thought just fuck that um two maybe it's just because the game sucks <laughs> okay I'll be fair um only the gameplay is good everything else sucks the graphics look muddy as shit the story was dumb the gem system is retarded the DLC was bullshit the roster sucks everything's trash it's basura man it blows like, nothing about it was good, and obviously if the players are giving up on the game and leaving, that's Capcom's fault. They're the ones who made the game. They fucked it up. They bum-rushed everything, so we have nothing to bitch about. All I'm saying is those who are diehard Marvel vs. Capcom fans obviously feel offended because this happened to their game. But in the end of the day, it is what it is. And honestly, I don't want to hear everyone bitching anymore because obviously it already happened. Just fucking get over it. You know what I'm trying to say? Okay. I know some of you guys are actually going to think I'm trying to be like insensitive or something. But honestly, I don't give a fuck. Okay. Um, I think one of the biggest... I, okay, I'm not going to lie. I think the biggest reason it didn't make it, I think it was just the competition. Look at all the games that fucking made it. As you can see here, you get Tekken 7, Blaze Blue, Cross Tag Battle. That's not even out yet. Injustice, both Smash games, Dragon Ball Fighter Z, Guilty Gear Rev 2, and even Street Fighter 5 Arcade Edition. Look at the competition. Now compare Marvel vs. Capcom with all of these games. Who wins? Everything else except Marvel, you know? Because Marvel's got nothing. It only got one fucking good quality. Everything else just sucks, you know? Fucking. I would rather have all three Smash games than I would for Marvel, no offense. That sounds really fucked up, but to be honest, all these other games I made it are actually a lot better. I'm actually very excited for this one. A lot of people are also calling this EVO lineup the anime EVO, because three out of the eight games are actually anime based, but who really gives a shit? If the games are good, fuck it, who cares, right? So who gives a flying fuck? But um, all I'm trying to say is those who are complaining that Marvel didn't make it, all I gotta say is just stop. It's already too late. They already announced it. What else can you possibly hear that would make it any better? It already happened, you know? Like, just fucking get over it. You know what I'm trying to say? Like, I know it sounds really fucked up to say, but to be honest, you guys bitching over and over again every fucking damn day doesn't do anything. They already decided. It already happened. It's too late. I also heard, like a little side note, I know this doesn't have nothing to do with it, but ever since the whole announcement of the EVO lineup, Marvel vs. Capcom Infinite has been like dropping in numbers like crazy. I heard like people just like quit and like gave up on the game. They're like, oh, I'm not even gonna bother wait till they like update it or whatever. They're just giving up, which is pretty sad because they had a potential to fix the game and shit, but it doesn't look like people are gonna wait for that now. Only the diehard fans might stay playing it. Everybody else is just fucking off. They don't care at this point. And honestly, I felt the same way. I was stupid enough to buy the game because I never thought it was gonna be shit. I thought, I was like, okay, I'll give it a try. In less than two weeks, I got bored of it, and then I'm like, you know what, I spent 60 bucks on a fucking game that I barely played two weeks on, and then that was it. I'm like, wow, what a fucking waste of money. I felt stupid buying it and shit, and I regret it too. At least it's going to side tournament, so you can't really be too mad about that, but don't expect the player base to be big. If Capcom wants this game to be relevant again, they're going to have to pull the big stops to get people back into it, but I don't really guarantee it. So there's that. Also, there's actually one video I want you guys to go check out. This guy's name is the Kef Crew, and fucking, he made a freaking skit about the whole evil lineup, and I thought it was really awesome, and I actually found it very entertaining. You should definitely go check that video, because it was actually really funny. And it's actually really cool. This guy's actually pretty cool as well. He makes really good content. Go check him out. And I know you're probably thinking, Cryo, you're supporting someone who's a lot bigger than you. Why are you doing that? Well, there's a simple answer to that, is because I don't care. But, no, yeah. I think this guy's cool. He's definitely an awesome person. Go check his channel out because this guy's really cool. I watched like a like 
I think 50 of his videos already, and I'm still watching the rest of them because they're actually really good. Go check this guy out. Show him some love. Let him know that I sent you, even though I barely have like 40 people. <laughs> yeah, that's not going to do shit. But anyway, yeah, um, there's that. New videos coming every Monday and Friday, sometimes Wednesdays. And I'll see you guys later. Mongol. Daddy's making a video.